Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome to my another tutorial on Android app development. In this video, I will try to show you how to create a music app in your Android application. Alright, so let's get started. First of all, what I need to do is I need to import the song which I want to play in my app. So let's get started. In here I have a song, so I will just copy it and where I have to paste it, I need to create another directory. So I have just one directory and I will rename it as the log. Alright, now in here I just need to paste the file. No. What I need to do is I need to uh, develop a UI design for my app. So I will just need three buttons here. Button 1 for play, button 2 for pause and button 3 for stop. Alright. So I just, I just rename them as play button. Similarly, score So, what I need to do is I need to import the icons. Where I have, I put the icons. These are the icons which I need to put. So I will just copy them and I need to paste them in drivers. Right. So first of all I will change the background of my app so that it looks good. Although I am not good in UI designing. But so I will just enjoyable and background. Alright. Now, what I need to do is similarly I need to the background in play. Similarly, we are done designing the UI now let's go to the this uh, activity or java file in here I don't need these imports I will also modify this at least so now what I need to do is I need to create three methods for my container of the app for multiple public void play Similarly, all songs and finally public void store. So, what I need to do is I need to initialize the class named media player. And in here, what I need to supply the element of this and then Alright, this is the name of the file. Now what I need to do is I just need to write player dot start. 
Okay. So, and uh, I have not. I want to click my shop, so I will here I will write in complete Python, similar to Python, and finally stop here. So, as I have done coding for uh, Python, uh, Python, now what I need to do is I need to write for source code. So, so in here I will write web dot stop, and I will. Alright, this is very simple, you know, a very simple app. So, what I need to do is just run here and there. taking some time so just wait as you can see now our app is running now if I press the play button the song will be played Alright, now if I press the stop button, as you can see the song is, is now stopped. If I play the uh, if I play the song again, and if I click on the stop and it gets stopped. Alright. Now if I click the stop again, what will happen? The app will crash. As you can see. Our app is now crashed. So what I need to do is here. I need to check here if player is null. So what you have to do is just if player equals to none and we have to uh, display a message song is already stopped alright so similarly in here we have to check if player equals to Then start uh, the song. Otherwise, just show a message. Song is already done. All right. So let's run the app again. So if I press the store button, the song is not playing, alright? So if I press the store button, as you can see, the song is already stopped. Now if I press again, as you, uh, you can see the song is already stopped. If I press play button, the song is now playing. If I press this uh, play button again, and you can see the song is already running, so I need to stop it. As you can see, the app is now stored. Alright, now I have done coding for the play and stop this song. Now, what I need to do is I need to write code for pause button. So, 
for that I need an integer this will save the current position of sound so integer false so here uh, uh, false method I need to just call it here so false and I need to get declare current position so for that I need to use pause and declare dot get current position and in here I need to check else else is clear dot is playing what we need to do here is just write clear before that I have to clear dot c2 and I will need to pass the uh, pass into the hair and then we have to start it alright so if I run the app again As you can see our app is not running if I click on play button and you can see the sound is not running if I press pause button as you can see there is now an error what the error is Sorry friends, there was a mistake. I just need to, to check if player is not playing the song. Alright. So let's run the app again. This was just a silly mistake. So what I need to do is I need to see the output again. As you can see our app is not running if I press on play button if I press pause button as you can see the song is now paused if I click on play button again it is the start from so if you like the video please subscribe to my channel thank you goodbye